Hey, for everybody who was in my encaustic class, this is that stuff that Christine told us about, that FOSS shape. I just got a sample in the mail. This is a thin one. And then I also got a thicker one. Feels a lot like felt. This is the kind of stuff that when you heat it or steam it, it'll make a hard sh Just opened it up, so I'm not going to start working on it until tomorrow. But I also got this stuff. It's pretty. It's about 50 yards of gold mesh. And, uh, like that. It's really flexible. I just used it. Let's see. I put it in the surface of a new encaustic piece. First I laid down a layer of wax on the board. And then, while it was warm, I took this and then laid it in. Then put another layer of wax over top and I burned it in. So, I know I've used a lot of stencils. This is the first time I've left a stencil-like material on. But, um, I was thinking of the the shine coming through for the subsequent layers or objects or materials or whatever I paint on this. A long time ago I did a piece that had um, gold leaf or composition leaf and I put it directly onto the wood and then painted over it and that was a really interesting piece uh, but I'm really enthralled with shiny things and I saw this this roll plus others like it were also on the website where I got the FOSS shape 